Good morning, everybody, on this Tuesday, September 3rd. And I am blue. <laughs> I'm very blue. The changing of the lighting. I am uh, working already. It's about 10 till 10. I have a conference call in 10 minutes that I have to get on. So I'm going to be doing that here momentarily. But I wanted to open the vlog because it is... Tuesday morning. I should be doing a foundation review today. I am not. I stink. Anyway, um, it's been a weird morning so far. I'm having issues trying to, uh, my red light started blinking. So sorry, I got distracted by that. Um, so I'm going to make this opening very, very short. Sorry about that. Anyway, I am, I'm working already and Um, anyway, so conference call in a few minutes. It is Tuesday morning. Everyone is back to work and school and I'm, I'm hungry. I gained a pound yesterday cause I ate so much. Um, and my blood sugar was elevated this morning, which is, is kind of unusual for me. Not terribly. It was 103. So 100 and under is non-diabetic. Um, and it was 103. So it wasn't terrible, but I think it's because of all of the like, treats I ate last night. Um, I did eat a regular Quest bar, not a Hero bar, and the Hero bars are the ones that have allulose. The regular Quest bar, I think, is erythritol. Not that erythritol usually increases my blood sugar, but I did eat that Atkins bar, and that might be what did it to me. So, I, I don't know. I think that's what it might be. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead, put you down, change out the battery because the red light is giving me anxiety, and I will check in at lunchtime with you guys because this morning uh, opening is so short. So I will see you guys in probably about an hour and a half. Well, y'all, it is lunchtime. I made my lunch. I've got a salad with lettuce that is a little worse for wear. I bought it last week. Actually, when did I buy it? Friday? Was that the day that John and I went to the grocery store together? I bought it a few days ago, basically. And about a quarter of the bag... Um, Whoops, put in the wrong email address. Um, about a quarter of the bag uh, was like see-through. You know how the lettuce gets see-through if it gets like, anyway. So I had to throw away about a quarter of the bag and hopefully I have enough salad to get me through today. Well, I know I have enough to get me through today, obviously, because I have my salad and then I should have enough for tomorrow as well. Um, and then I made a quesadilla, although I do have some lunch meat that I need to eat. Um, I did see a YouTuber do a, what are they, what do they call it? Um, enchilada. Um, using lunch meat and cheese, which I want to do. Uh, I don't have any enchilada sauce. We do have some salsa though. So I don't know. I'm going to take a look at doing that maybe tomorrow for lunch, but not today. I made my quesadilla today and I have my salad. So I might do a um, quesadilla or a enchilada and a salad uh, might be what I do. So, but it is midday. Like I said, it's 11.55, 11.56. Um, moving right along for work today. Today, I'm going to be trying to get some training done this afternoon. My virtual desktop is for some reason not letting me into the training site, but my plain regular old no, you know, regular desktop lets me in. So I'm going to maybe do some stuff on, you know, outside of the virtual desktop to work on my training. Um, yeah. So that's, I think, my, my plan for this afternoon is to work on some training. I have, I have to travel the last week in September, first week in October for training classes. I am going to Maryland for one and Virginia for the other. And, um, yeah. So sorry. I'm just like ugh, two, two back to back weeks, but I get to come home on the weekend. But anyway, I'm going to be doing those back to back travel and I have to do like some prep work for those classes, do some pre-work. And that's what I'm going to try to get done today. Um, because I do travel in like three weeks. Let me double check. I think it's three weeks. It might be four. Yeah, three weeks from yesterday, I will be in my first class, and then four weeks from today, because my other class doesn't start till Tuesday, I will be in my second class. So, 
I have three weeks to get it done and I have time today to try to get that training, uh, the pre-work done. And that doesn't happen very often. So I am going to try to get that done today. Anyway, I'm going to get back to work. I'm going to eat my lunch before it gets cold and, uh, well, my before my KSD gets cold. So I'm going to get back to work and I will see you guys later today. Bye. Well, y'all, it is end of the work day and I am very, very frustrated, but I will fill you in on that later. Uh, it is, what time is it? It's like 6.35. John and I are going to go to the gym. Isn't that cool? My husband's going to the gym with me. Um, Nicholas is a big 12 year old. He's going to stay here while we're gone. We're only going to be gone for about an hour, but he's going to stay here while we're gone. So we are going to go to the gym. I've got my new leggings on. You can see them. They're green and I'm just wearing the shirt I had on all day. So this is not going to be different, but I don't really sweat when I go to the gym. <laughs> uh, I'm a big wuss when I go to the gym. Pretty much. I just walk on the treadmill for like 20 minutes. Just an, I do enough to burn like a hundred calories and then I like with, lift a little bit of weights. I did legs the other night, so I'm probably going to do arms today or maybe my abs today. Um, but anyway, that's kind of where we're at. We're going to go to the gym. Are you excited? What? You excited to go to the gym with me? Do I want to say anything? I said, are you excited that you're going to go to the gym with me? Oh yeah. I'm lit up. Anyway, we're gonna go to the gym. I just wanted to say hello before we uh, before we headed off. We had uh, chicken and I had eggs as my side for my chicken. And John's like, it's kind of a little bit weird that you're eating the chicken and the egg. Anyway, we're gonna go to the gym. I just wanted to say hello. It is only, like I said, 6.35. We're gonna be home around 7.30, eight o'clock somewhere in there. Probably gonna be home around eight o'clock because John will want to watch wrestling. So, um, yeah. Anyway, I, um, I don't know that I'm going to film anything tonight. Tomorrow's Wednesday already. I probably should post my what I ate in a day tomorrow. So anyway, I'll figure it out while I'm at the gym. We'll see you later. Well, y'all, it is time for bed. I already put my, my watch on night mode. It is 1025. It's time for bed. And I'm kind of sad tonight. I um, I was conversing with one of you guys, Lisa, via e comments tonight because I found out that somebody who's been a part of my YouTube journey for a long time stopped following me. And actually what's funny is, is most of you all have been here for a long time. You guys that do watch me have been here for a long time, and I do appreciate every one of you. One thing that I'm terrible at, and I know that I'm terrible at, is comments. And it's not just on YouTube. I am terrible at responding to emails, too. My <laughs> so, uh, the, earlier this year, I have an inbox at work. I actually created an archived inbox to dump out everything that was older than... I think I think it was January 1st. I think I put all of 2018 emails in the archive in the inbox. So it's got like emails from I think January. It might have only it might have actually been maybe March. I don't think it was the summer. It, it was either the last six months or nine months worth of emails in my inbox. My in my inbox proper. Today I officially broke 2,000 unread emails in my inbox. And that doesn't include any of the unread emails that were in my archived inbox from 2018. And I actually read all of my comments on YouTube. <laughs> I actually read every comment I get on YouTube. I just am not good at responding. And I've told my employees this. I've said, um, if you send me an email and you don't hear back from me for like a day or two, send me a follow-up email or send me an instant message or something because chances are I might have read it and didn't respond or maybe I just completely missed it. Um, because it's not just the 2,000 emails that I have in my inbox that are unread. I have, like, the way I organize my emails, I have individual folders for people that I get a lot of email from. So, like, my boss has an individual folder. He's only been my boss since... June 
I think June, July, in May, somewhere in May, June, July time frame is when I got my new boss. He has 170 unread emails in his folder. Now I will say this, because of the way I sort my mail um, into folders, there are often times that I will read m email messages, but it will be like, I will read the last email in the email chain. And there might have been five or six emails and I only read the sixth one. So I never end up reading the other five. That's oftentimes a lot of what happens, but I'm just really bad with doing that. And I don't know why. I know some people who are like um, really big on the whole, I want um, a zero, zero inbox or whatever, zero emails in my inbox. They, they, they've read and responded or handled every single email that's in their inbox. That is not my thing. <laughs> Let me show you, hold on. So on my phone, I have, I'm gonna tell you how many email email addresses I have attached to my phone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have eleven email boxes attached to my phone. Can you guys see that number there? One hundred eighteen thousand five hundred and seventy-two unread emails. I actually read my comments on YouTube. <laughs> And I appreciate every single one of them. I'm just really bad at that. Anyway. I'm ready for bed. And today, I want to say that I'm thankful to all of you who have been with me on this YouTube journey and continue to come back and watch me. Whether it be just on this vlog channel, whether it be my Omni Z channel, whether it be my Epic Beauty Fail channel, or all three. Some of you guys watch me on all three channels, some of you watch me on two channels, some of you watch me on just one channel, but I'm thankful for all of you. And I want to absolutely say that I'm thankful for the time that I had with um, the person who has stopped following me. Um... And they didn't just stop following me on YouTube, they stopped following me on Twitter, on Instagram, um, everything. And I will miss them. They were um, very much a support, a supporter of mine. And uh, I'll miss them. So... I appreciate anybody who's willing to give their time to me. And that means a lot from an extreme introvert. <laughs> anyway, John's standing up, dancing around the room, trying to be quiet and not getting in bed because he doesn't want to get on camera. So I'm going to wrap up the vlog. I hope today was better than yesterday. And I hope tomorrow will be just a little bit better than today. I hope y'all are having a great day, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.